70 million years ago, the skies belonged to giants. This is Quetzalcatlus, the largest creature ever to fly. With eyesight eight times sharper than our, it spots prey from impossible heights. The dive begins. kilometers per hour. Perfect. A two-meter beak, sharp as a spear. But survival in the age of giants demands more than skill. This is its story. Late Cretaceous North America. A world of water, fire, and endless competition. Standing tall as a giraffe, weighing a quarter ton, Quetzalcoatlus dominated every landscape it walked. Recent discoveries suggest it spent most of its life on the ground, walking like a four-legged giraffe hunting like a giant stork. This river valley is its territory. 50 square kilometers of prime hunting ground. But when it needs to fly, it pole vaults into the air using its wings as front legs. Zero to flight in one second. This territory is not uncontested. A rival, smaller but bold enough to challenge. 12 meters of pure intimidation. Sometimes a show of force is enough. But ruling the skies requires constant vigilance. It must eat its body weight in food every three days. Target acquired. Every dive is a calculated risk, miss, and it means hours of wasted energy. Split second calculations, wind speed, water depth, prey movement. meter beak, sharp as a spear. But getting out is the hard part. Not every hunt is elegant. Problem solved. Time to do. In this world, nothing is wasted. Every calorie is survival.
Discretion is the better part of valor. Sometimes survival means knowing when to leave. But from one danger into another. One step at a time. Safety. Hard won and temporary. Time passes. The body heals. Dawn brings hope and renews strength. From darkness into dawn. The moment of truth. Can it fly? Flies! But barely! at a price. <sighs> has survived, and life continues. Knowledge passes, generation to generation. A survivor among survivors, part of something larger. Each scar tells a story of survival earned. Still it fly. The day ends. Tomorrow will come. Night falls. Life continues. 70 million years ago, this world thrived. And for a moment, so did they. <laughs> <laughs>